Did you know that if you ask somebody to hold something warm, there's a greater chance that they'll feel warmly towards you? You can't make this stuff up. But that isn't the psychological principle that I've brought you out for a coffee to talk about. I want to talk to you about reciprocity. Reciprocity is the psychological principle whereby if somebody does something for you, you're more likely to do something for them. And in marketing terms, the idea is that somebody gives you a free video, a free download, lets you join their mailing list. You in turn will feel some sort of sense of obligation to then buy from them down the line. My view is that this is the weakest principle of um, persuasion when it comes to marketing, particularly because these days it's, ex it's expected. It's expected that you'll come to a website and there'll be a free download or a mailing list or a checklist or a video or something. So the idea that giving somebody a download checklist video or whatever is suddenly going to make them think, crikey, I better buy something from this person, doesn't seem plausible to me. But what I think is possible is that if over time you continue to give value, then you could trigger a sense of reciprocity. If somebody thinks, you know what, I've had a lot of free advice over time from this source and now they're saying, oh, you know, I've got a course in this or I've got, you know, something for sale, I might be more likely to buy it even if I'm not certain that it's worth the price because I've put a price on what I've received already. So I think it's still well worth considering what are you giving away to trigger some sort of sense of reciprocity, but if you're expecting an immediate quid pro quo, then I think you're going to be disappointed. But what is it that you're giving away to start the reciprocity ball rolling?